everyone for some more of my Burry career mode for FIFA 19. And without further ado, let's get into this away game against Everton. Okay, let's take a look at Burry's kits. That away kit actually looks really, really good. I like that a lot. And you can see there's the, um... The home kit, which I'm going to put the home kit even on, even though I'm on the road. And of course, you guys seen what Everton's kits look like. And I'm going to be playing with a starting 11. I really should have Kanate and Fafana, but I think I'm going to save them for the next video. But anyway, without further ado, let's see how good this team is. I can't wait to see, because like I said in the last video, this is not a team that I made. This is... This whole career mode is dedicated to the Master Bucks, so... But yeah, this is going to be the very first Premier League game I'm going to be playing with Burry. And as you can see, Raheem Sterling got the captain's armband. Might as well give the captaincy to an English player. But yeah, that looks awesome. Yeah, I can't wait to see how well this Barry team plays. A lot of players I haven't even played with before. Uh, Munier I haven't played with. Uh, Mustasi I've never played with. Um, who else? Mario Balotelli I've not played with since FIFA 10, so it'll be, it's going to be interesting playing with him again. But, um, but yeah, you can see... Uh, the Everton starting lineup, that's pretty much the same starting li a lineup that they have in life with Charleston is up front. Uh, it doesn't look like they made any transfers yet. But you can see there's my team. Camp, who I've never played with before. Lopez, I've never played with before. Herving Lozano, I've never played with before either. So, yeah, I'm very excited to see what this team feels like. Oh! So far, Everton doing a good job keeping the ball. Okay, screw it. And that- Oh! How unlucky by Kevin Campbell! Okay, oh. Okay, can Sterling get on the end of that? No, he can't. Munia passing into Sarabia. Screw it. Oh, he hits the post again! How unlucky has Kevin Campbell been so far? And Raheem Sterling, the captain, makes it one nothing in the seventh minute for number seven. Oh, I feel so sad for Kevin Campbell. I kind of want Kevin Campbell to get a goal now. Okay, let's work out wide. Sarabia with the ball. And good block. Okay, Nastasic going to get at the end of this, almost, but Sané is right there. The two former Manchester City players hooking up the goal so far. Awesome stuff. Yeah, I'm kind of hell-bent to give get Kevin Campbell a goal now. Okay, Alonso, the former Chelsea player. Okay, let's try this again. Please do not hit the post. He hit the post a third time! Ow. That has to be an, an anomaly. I've never had it before where a player was that unlucky. Okay. Okay, let's try this again. Oh. Ziek blocked him. I'm trying to get the ball to Campbell. I want Campbell to score. Martinez. Okay, Campbell. And they didn't hit the post that time. If he would have hit the post again, I think I actually would have literally started crying. <laughs> but yeah, Campbell gets on the, sh uh, uh, on the uh, score sheet. And deservedly so. He's worked his tail off so far in this game. Joseph Martinez. Oh, what was that from um, Jordan Pickford and... Martinez 
Should have done a lot better with that. Joseph Martinez trying a little bit too hard there. Okay, nice. And top in. Joseph Martinez absolutely tearing it up in the MLS so far. He scored in like 16 consecutive games so far, which is by far an MLS record. And he's definitely a big reason why Atlanta United are once again MLS Cup contenders. I mean, they are the reigning champs, but they're definitely not the favorites right now. The favorites to win that particular league is um, LAFC. Okay, Zia, can he score? Yes, he can. By the way, I, I apologize if you hear yelling at that in the background. I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> okay, Zia complain. Actually, no, that's not Zia. That's Martinez. Okay, Leroy Sane. Raheem Sterling. Kind of the latest. Go and that was a weird goal. Okay, celebrate with... Ziak, what are you doing, Sterling? <laughs> By the way, Raheem Sterling, last time I saw he was an he had an he has an eighty eight rating in FIFA twenty. And speaking of FIFA twenty, it's not it's not it's a game that I'm not gonna be playing straight away. Because, obviously, I do have plans for FIFA 19 yet that I want to fulfill, but, uh, but yeah, it's ZX turn to hit the post now, but, but yeah, I'm not going to be playing FIFA 20 straight away, but, um, yeah, I'm actually looking forward to it, but, um, but yeah, there's a lot of stuff in FIFA 19 I want to do yet before I even think about playing, uh, FIFA 20 and making FIFA 20 content in my channel. And then, like I said before, the first career mode I'm going to be playing in FIFA 20 is going to be Newcastle United. Since I didn't get to play them on camera in FIFA 19. And I didn't even look if Barry was actually in FIFA 20. I know they got expelled from the, uh, the league in real life, but I don't know if they're actually in FIFA 20. I'd like to think that they are, but I don't know for sure. And Raheem Sterling gets his hat trick. Yeah, I'm going to have to look that up after this is over and see, because I would like to think they are in FIFA 20 even though they got kicked out of the league. I don't, I can't see how they would change or get them out and make a fake team in a short amount of time, but I mean, they were able to turn Juventus into a Piemonte Cal a Calcio, so, but yeah, I honestly don't know what they're going to do about Barry in FIFA 20. Joseph Martinez gets his second goal. Telling the away crowd to calm down. Hey, I'm the man here. Had a bit of a shaky start, but he's starting to find his rhythm now. Now it's actually a very nice finish. I think it's actually supposed to be pronounced Joseph Martinez, not Joseph Martinez. Kevin Campbell, can you hit the post again? Yep, that is four times in this game that he's hit the post off a long shot. Okay, Martinez, can you get the hat trick? Yes, you can. But yeah, four times he's hit the post in this game. The guy cannot catch a break. And even in the go even the goal he scored, he almost hit the post. Yeah, unlucky. Okay, let's Campbell. No, he was off the mark. He really should have had a, at least a hat trick in this game. I feel, I feel so bad for him. I really do. Five shots, four of them have hit the post and one of them found the back of the net, but... 
Oh, I don't want to pass it back. Okay, pass it to Campbell. Crap. And that would have went in. <laughs> but there we go. Halftime lead at Goodison Park. Okay, let's see what my team looks like right now. They're, they're doing all right. Okay, Kevin Campbell. I, I want to try to at least... Shot blocks. Oh, if it's not the Everton guy blocking, it's my own guy. Nice. And that was off the mark. That's about the only time he's not going to hit the post. Yeah, I feel bad for the guy. He's pretty much doing everything right except score. Nice slide by Raheem Sterling. That was absolutely beautiful. Look how silky smooth that was. Holy crap. Campbell gets knocked off the ball. Okay, Kevin Campbell hit the post there. Yeah, Kevin Campbell should have had at least three or four goals by now. He's been very unlucky in this game. Oh, oh nice! That was a good goal by Kevin Campbell. And that's his second goal of the game, which, like I said before, he should have had a lot more than that. But I can't really fault him. He's had some good looks. Okay, Joseph Martinez. Okay, Leo Isani off a bad angle, but Pablo Sarabia is right there. Should actually think about making some changes now. Okay, let's see who's tired. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Okay, you can only play out in the wing. This is what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to move Sterling to the striking position because he can play there. Martinez is going to sub be subbed off for Lozano. Uh, I'll put, I'll put uh, Bana 8 Banasso in there and see what he's like. And um, Ziyech. I'll put Balotelli in there. See what he's... Actually, let me change formation. Yeah, let me change formation to a 4-4-2 flat. Sane gets put there. Balotelli there. And then... There we go. That's how I have it for the remainder of the game. You see, well, I can already see how big of a how big of a presence Mario Balotelli is. I mean, he's very noticeable out there. Balotelli, how are you? That's a good. That's a good start. Mario Balotelli is one of those, one of those players who just keeps on getting uh, linked with Newcastle for some weird reason. It's not like they're ever gonna buy him, but still, it'd be interesting. I don't know what, what kind of job he would do had if he would come to Newcastle. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how that would work out. Okay, Sterling. I see Balotelli. 
he just made that look too easy. Galatelli trying to force a mistake. Good work. Okay, Sterling passing it to Mustafi. To eight Benasser. Good save there by Pickford. Don't really say that too often. Okay, who can I... That's who I wanted it to go to. Marcus Alonso, can you get ahead on that? And that's exactly why I targeted him. But yeah, for the most part, this team actually feels really good. Okay, how good is your crossing? Eh. Yeah, there's no way he was going to score like that. Okay, Munier. Herbig Lozano. It's hard to believe this is actually the first time I've played with Herbig Lozano. And that was a good header by Leroy Sonner. I did not expect to score that. I honestly did not expect to score that. Okay, nice, still. Kevin Campbell, can you get a hat trick? And yes, you can. And what a way to end this episode, but you see Kevin Campbell getting a hard-earned hat-trick. Especially all that he's gone through in this game. Hit the post four times. Yeah, I'm just going to keep the ball now. Yeah, a lot of these players, which, that's another reason why I, why I wanted to do this particular career mode, because a lot of these players like Marcos Alonso, uh, Alonso Skojan Mustafi, um, Thomas Munier, Nastasic, a lot of these players I have not played with in FIFA 19, so this gives me the perfect opportunity to do so. Anthony Lopez is a player I've never bought in FIFA 19 before either, so it's nice actually playing with them. And there we go, that is the end of the game. And even the players that I brought in are players that I've never played before, um, Ziek and um, Martinez. Well, actually, that's a lie because Martinez I bought in my Nottingham Forest career mode that I played off camera. But he's... This is actually only the second time I've actually been playing with Joseph Martinez. Okay, man, the match actually went to Munier, which is interesting. Okay, let's see. Four goals to assist, two goals for assist for Sane. Hmm. You know, I'm going to give man of the match to captain Raheem Sterling for four goals and two assists. 4 out of 4 on target, 6 out of 6 passing, 4 out of 4 dribbling, 1 out of 1 crossing, 2 out of 2 tackles, 1. He was absolutely perfect today, and that's exactly what I expect from the captain of my team, so... Well, technically it's Master Buck's team, but it's the team I'm using right now, so good job with Raheem Sterling. Okay, Nastasic is happy. Okay, you see a lot of players going out on uh, international duty. And the board is very happy with how I've been playing so far, so that hopefully it'll stay like that. But yeah, like I said before, well, not before, but the uh, the last video, I'm thinking the next video I'm going to do, because I do want to play a home Premier League game, and that's going to be against Tottenham, so that will be the next time I see you guys. So, but it sounds like I say so a lot, and I know I do say so a lot, but and I do apologize, but um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this. Hope you guys are enjoying this series. I'll be seeing you guys again next time.